10 o'clock, a thief caught on camera in broad daylight stealing pride flags from the First Christian Church in Katy. The Reverend telling our Rochelle Turner this is not the first time the church has been targeted. It's Pride Month and the First Christian Church off Morton Ranch Road near Katy is all about supporting the LGBTQ plus community. We always have a little extra color out on the street. We always fly a pride flag. There's always going to be a rainbow flag out front. Reverend Heather Tolleson says 16 pride flags like these have been stolen in the past 10 days and says at least 40 were taken in the past 10 months. Yesterday's event happened at 1041 in the morning. I came in to work and left for a meeting and when I came back the flags were gone. Take a look at this security video. A black Chevrolet Silverado pulls into the parking lot. A man gets out the truck, walks over to the flags and cuts them down. He gets back in his truck holding several flags before driving off. Reverend Tolleson says the church is being targeted for their beliefs. Oh, a hundred percent. I, I, I believe the church is being targeted, but more specifically, it's the queer LGBT community that's being targeted. I think in the Katy area, we've been very lucky to be a representation of that, a pretty bold, um, outward facing representation of that. So it's not just about church, um, being part of this community as much as it is the community itself. Earlier this month and last September, the church held a drag bingo event to raise money for trans youth. Supporters and protesters expressed their views. Reverend Tolleson says the LGBTQ plus community is already facing a lot with the Texas legislation. She has a message to the person who keeps stealing pride flags from the church property. I hope we live in a world where we can be adults and exist even when we don't share the same values to recognize the humanity in one another and begin to figure out ways to uplift that even through our differences. Reporting in the Katy area. I'm Rochelle Turner, KPRC 2 News. Reverend Tolson says people from all over the nation have already mailed in replacement flags. If you recognize the man in that video, contact the Harris County Sheriff's Office. Only